construction and working principle of drilling machine. Drilling machine the process of drilling means making a hole in a solid metal piece by using a rotating tool called drill. In the olden days, a flat drill was used for drilling a hole, but these days, a twist drill is universally used. A twist drill is the cutting tool, and it is used in conjunction with a drilling machine. A twist drill has two cutting edges, hence it is a multiple point cutting tool. A twist drill has two cutting edges, hence it is a multiple point cutting tool. The drilling operation is shown in figure twist drill. It is usually have a taper shank at the end, which is fitted into the drilling machine, having a tapered sleeve of matching taper. When the tapered sleeve rotates, the twist drill also rotates along with it, due to the friction between two tapered surfaces. Sometimes the shank is machine parallel, then a special call a chuck is fitted in the drilling machine, in which the drill is held. The drill has two lips at the other end where the cutting takes place, when the drill rotates. The angle between the two cutting lips is usually 118 degrees. The chips formed at the cutting edges are automatically guided upwards through the helical grooves cut into the body of the drill. These grooves are called flutes. This is necessary, otherwise, the chips will interfere with the metal cutting. For rotating the drill and to overcome the resistance in cutting, a torque is needed to rotate the drill. An axial force is also needed which keeps pushing the drill deeper and deeper into the hole being drilled. This is provided by the machine feed. Machine feed is the downward axial movement of the drill per revolution of drill. To facilitate the cutting action, a little depression is made by a punch at the center of the hole to be drilled. Twist drills are made of solid high-speed steel, hardened and ground to shape. Drills with tungsten carbide inserts are also available. Drilling machines classification of drilling machines are first one sensitive drilling machines, second pillar type drilling machines, third radial drilling machines, and final one multi-spindle drilling machines. Sensitive drilling machines. A sensitive drilling machine is shown in figure. This is a light duty machine and is capable of drilling a hole of 12 mm diameter maximum, and its spindle speeds are correspondingly high. This machine can tackle small jobs. The workpiece is kept on the table and clamped in the appropriate position, and the hole is drilled by lowering the spindle of the drilling head. Feed is given by moving the hand wheel gently which lowers the spindle, and the hole is drilled up to the required depth. Remember that the job has to be moved so as to align the center of hole exactly below the spindle. Pillar type drilling machines. These are generally similar to sensitive drilling machines, but are meant for heavier work. The vertical column can be either a rectangular or round section. The latter offers the advantage that the table can be swung out, and the slightly bigger jobs can be accommodated on the machine base instead of the table. The drilling head can be lowered and hole drilled in the job. Radial drilling machine. A radial drilling machine is illustrated in figure. This is really meant to drill holes in bigger and heavier workpieces, which cannot be manipulated, so that the center of the hole may be aligned with the drilling spindle. In this case, the drilling head is mounted on a radial arm. The radial arm can be rotated around the round column, and the drilling head can be moved in or out on the radial arm. The workpiece is kept on the table which is really an integral part of the base, and by the combined movement of the radial arm and the drilling head, any point on the workpiece can be covered and a hole drilled at the required location, without shifting the heavy workpiece. <laughs>